Hi everyone. First of all, a very happy new year to everybody. Um, I haven't been posting any videos for the past two, three weeks because I have been out of the country. Uh, specifically, I visited India and I'm very excited to share this video with you because I got a lot of instant pot inserts. So I wanted to share what the inserts are and um, just kind of show you different options that I wanted to try out uh, to do multi uh, multi-dish cooking so first of all i wanted to kind of uh, tell you a little bit about my instant pot which i haven't done previously uh, my instant pot is i believe the lux lux 60 and it's a six quart insert uh this the uh, instant pot with the insert that is six quart and it measures approximately 8.5 inches as the internal diameter so uh previously i had uh, if you saw any of my previous videos, I had similar to these two stackable units and uh, I got some new ones. So these are that's a shiny and new, uh, but these are roughly six and a half inches across. So as you can see, let's see if I can do this. But if as you can see, these are. Right? So they are six and a half inches across roughly and they're about I believe like a three inch height. So I wanted to show this to you. Um, do you see that? So they're about a little like two and a half inches of height and these are the taller ones. So these can stack on top of each other and you can put it in here directly. Uh, with some water if you're just doing two dishes sorry about that or I have this stand of mine that I mostly use this came with my instant pot so my instant pot I got I believe in 2012 and this is where that uh, stand came in and so I generally do this where I would stack it it comes a little bit above but it generally works uh, so what I wanted to do is since you can see let me show this to you again there's a roughly like a inch uh, gap and all other sides of this and I wanted to get some wider uh, inserts So here's what I got Ta-da! So uh, These are a lot these won't stack up all at the same time, but as you can see um, Let me show you to do there are three of these that are uh, Smaller height, so let's see this one And as you can see this is a much smaller height compared to like this one here You see that? So, if I were to show this to you, then I would say this is roughly two inches. So, it's half an inch smaller. But you can also see that, as you can see, the, the one here is uh, wider. So, this was six and a half, whereas this is roughly seven and a half inches of width. So, again, find the, I'm going to show this to you. Uh, as you can see that. That's seven and a half inches so I got three of these uh, which are similar and again they're all stackable and these all three can go in at one time uh, which is totally fine like without the stand they can go in so I wanted to again show this to you if I were to put this in with the stand I can do one two yeah and that's mostly it I this will not work okay so again it's for cooking three things at the same time where you can do one at the base of this and two in these uh, inserts if I were to remove the stand then all three of these would stack up easily into the instant pot so again putting in two and then the third one here uh, with a little room left on the top which is perfectly fine okay. now to show you one more here so as you can see again I have another one here and that is basically the seven and a half inches in diameter but taller than this one here so this one is similar to height in in the smaller one I showed you but wider so again what that would help me again is to do I can easily do three things at a time with the more uh, so if you have some larger quantity of uh, 
vegetable or rice that you want to cook you can do that but again this allows me to do three things at a time and you can see now I have still have a half an inch room left on the sides of this so I can take this out either with my hands if I am brave enough but I would not advise that so you have seen in a previous videos I use these tongs uh, also known as sansi or pakkad in Hindi and I use generally that to lift my inserts out which is much safer don't want to be burning your hands and there is still enough room on the sides for me to do that so this is how I do it so that is it these are my brand new shiny new inserts and I'm really excited so I got these from India and these are roughly like they vary because of the size and the height they vary anywhere from seven dollars to about twelve dollars which is much less than what you find on Amazon so I'm gonna find some cheaper alternatives and see if I can post links below uh, but again if you're making a trip to India this is the best way to get it you would not want to book a flight just to buy these but if you're already there and you're or you're going so anytime soon I would suggest you can get these in any store that sells your regular old pressure cookers or any steel shop that sells like steel utensils and you can find these there uh, I did want to show you a couple of more things that I have uh, I did buy and they were also kind of in my previous videos so just making a room here you had seen this um, what I what is known as a tadka pan and so I have used this when I do dals just to do tempering on top or what you call a tarka or chonk I use this so this is I, I got a new one this has a slightly uh, taller uh, cup here mine was a little bit shallow from before and it also has this rest over here I used to I used to have to like you know <laughs> rest it on something previously I did, mine did not have this so this is a new thing I got again um, these are relatively like I believe five six dollars not much uh, in India and I'll post an alternate link from Amazon uh, to something similar in the description box below. And then one final thing what I got is this. And uh, if you have seen uh, one of my first videos where I mashed the uh, lentils, uh, I have a wooden one and I thought I'll try a steel one here. So again, you basically are gonna, if your dal is in here, you can uh, uh, rotate this around and kind of mushes the dal. You can also use this to uh, make lassi when you have your yogurt uh, you want to make a smoothie it's, it kind of works like a whisk but slightly differently so that's the idea behind this and so this is a steel one so those are my uh, my shopping from India that relates to my instant pot cooking I hope this was helpful to you please let me know if you want to watch any other videos or need any other information I'll try and make videos on those and then very soon I'll try and come up with some more new recipes with the instant pot so stay tuned and subscribe to my channel thank you so much bye